geeks and fans. Yeah, welcome to Spectacling Radio, straight out of the theater review. It's been a while, it hasn't really been anything out like that. We're not gonna talk about Borderlands. I didn't go see that, so sorry. Sorry, we're not doing that. <laughs> but anyway, um, so basically, me and the missus are gonna go see 1992. You know what I'm saying? The Tyrese Gibson movie. See what it is. I saw the trailer again. I saw it the first time and I was like, hmm. It looks pretty cool. And then I saw it again when I actually showed her. And I was like, oh, actually, looks like it's actually better than I actually anticipated. So we're going to see. See if uh, Tyrese, Tyrese Gibson is uh, going to bring it. I uh, hope it's better than the, the last Fast and Furious movie. Ooh, sign up playing. Nah, <laughs> Fast and Furious is okay. Uh, I think this is probably going to be better. So say hi to the missus. We'll be out here. Ooh, all right. About to make it happen. I'll see y'all next time. Well, I'll see y'all when I do the review. After the movie, I had to stand by the uh, billion dollar poster. Let me see if I can get this right here. Yes, that is gonna be, I, I don't care what people say, that's gonna be a billion dollar movie when it comes out. I have to take my daughter to go see it. You gotta get here a couple of days early to get whatever Moana popcorn bucket is gonna come out. But y'all here, y'all not here to talk about. Uh, we're not here to talk about Moana too. <laughs> of course we'll do a review for that. But anyway, um, Real quick, because, uh, yeah, it's late, and we're going to get up out of this theater. Um, 1992 was definitely good. Tyrese um, did a great job. Um, it gave me taker slash set it off slash a little bit of training day vibes. And I say training day as far as, like, kind of some of the direction style. I thought it was really uh, masterful um, as far as that uh, direction is concerned and stuff like that. Um, I didn't even know Ray. Uh, I'm talking with uh, Leota. Leota, I think. I didn't know he passed, so... Um, definitely rest in peace. He did a he did a great job. Um, uh, Scott, it was, um, Clint Eastwood's son, right? Was in it. That was his son, right? I think that is Clint Eastwood. I think it is. Um, yeah, no, <laughs> his son did a great job. Um, it, it, it was definitely meaningful, um, and it was some, one situation. I'm not going to spoil anything, but one situation at the end was like it was real life. It's, you know, so you would think it's about to be this moment where, of course, my has dialogue. You call me, blah blah blah, blank blank, so and so, and then a blank character, you know, did something to another blank character mid dialogue. It was real, like real life. You talking, but nah, we we about to get the smoke. So, but uh, <laughs> if I was a scale of one to ten, though, I would say. I'll say seven and a half, uh, solid, close to eight. You know, it was definitely good. I don't, I don't know if it's going to be in my top 10, but no, sorry, did a good job. It was good. Um, little indie movie and stuff like that. You know, I hope I get a chance to have, you know, one of our productions be on the quality of that, though. Um, the action looked good. It didn't look, you know, fake. And then the camera wasn't shaking everywhere or anything like that. So, um, yeah, yeah, seven and a half, you know, close to a solid eight and stuff like that. So it was just good to be in the theater again, being, you know, being with the missus and, uh, just, you know, checking out a movie and stuff like that. 1992, uh, I do recommend if you like, you know, takers and set it off and, you know, training day and, you know, gritty, you know, movies like that. I think you'll, you'll like this one a lot. Um, so it's definitely a good, good, you know, just night out, you know what I'm saying? Just kind of getting into a gritty crime drama action hood movie and stuff like that so yeah the trailer oh that scene what was it he said uh in the trailer he was like he was like how does that feel hobie he was like familiar i was like yo that was his uh his uh like punisher moment like you know what i'm saying like I, i've been through this it's gritty you know this type of thing but we gotta get out of here and grab these kids but movie was great follow subscribe like fact link radio we're definitely gonna talk about it a little bit more i think some of the guys are gonna go check it out as well so when we do the podcast not this upcoming sunday but the following sunday uh we we'll definitely have this on the list you just kind of break gloss over it talk about it a little bit more see what their impressions were uh we appreciate you guys i'm andre brown spectacular radio we check you out next time thanks for all the support